everybody welcome back to my channel so happy to see all of my Disney peaches today and y'all I have a humongous haul for you today um things have just been coming in one right after the other and I was like oh my goodness I've got to do another haul video so I still have some things that come in that haven't come in yet so I'll have some stuff even after this so um I'm just so excited to share it all with you today so if you want to see what I've got to share today you come on back to always start out with a bang and y'all I'm so excited over this bag I almost didn't get it but I did and um let me tell you I was thrilled so now I have two whether they're gonna come out with more or not I have no idea but ah, I got the new um yellow gold iridescent uh 50th anniversary mini backpack from loungefly it's a, a parks exclusive and it says disney parks on it right up here and uh, let me just take these little ears off oh. this is absolutely gorgeous i mean look at those colors I believe I shared this on Facebook, not Facebook, Instagram, uh, as soon as I got it. And I just, oh my goodness, words just don't do it justice. But it's all sequins on the front pocket. And it has this beautiful blue trim. And the bow is sequins. The ears are sequins. But then everything else is in this um, iridescent... Um, type material where it, it just shimmers and glimmers with all of the light it does have side pockets here um the blue is blue on the inside so that's just such a lovely color trim for this bag and you can see the other pocket over here it has my favorite gold hardware and it has the blue trim going around the zipper as well the back has got the blue back straps with the blue extension uh, straps as well and the back is just plain it just has that iridescent uh, shimmer and Oh, I just love it. It is the original silhouette from Loungefly. The small front pocket and just your two side pockets on the side. And let's look inside. I don't even know if I've looked inside. I haven't. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is so pretty. Look at this interior lining. Isn't that pretty? It's just a like a denim blue and then it has dark silhouettes of Mickey. I love it. Let's see if there's a zipper. There is not a zipper at all and there is not a slip pocket on the front either. So this one is really really exactly like the original um, silhouette. Um, where it's just no pockets on the inside and it's got the uh, front pocket and the two side pockets but I love it it is so beautiful y'all let me get my original one the the one in the pink uh, like the uh, rose gold and let's look at them together okay y'all I've got the pink one that was the original and I absolutely love it and now we have the yellow gold. So you can see them both side by side. Aren't they beautiful? And they are clearly different. Um, so, you know, you definitely want to have both of these. Even though they both are similar, they're very different. And I love it. But absolutely 
freaking love these. I'm so glad I've been able to get both so far and uh, love them so much. Like I said, y'all, I've got so much to share with you today. I don't even know what to do next, but I'm going to do something that's really good next. And it came in in the last couple of days. And it is this gorgeous Mickey's Main Attraction. Uh, this is supposed to represent um, Space Mountain. Um, I did not collect the backpacks. I've only got one pack, one backpack from the Minnie Mouse Main Attractions. And it is this one right here. And I just love that one. So I wanted that one. And this is the only one that I, I wasn't even going to get this. And then, you know, spur of the moment, it jumps on you and you're like, oh, I think I need to get it. What if I really want it? So, I got it. I do love how the white is like a patent leather. I love patent leather. Maybe it's the era that I grew up in, but everything feels like patent leather but in different colors but you have um the purple here that looks like a galaxy and there's a little hidden mickey right here i'll bring this up in a minute the beautiful white logo tag the um the uh ears are not sequins they're glitter so the ears are more glitter and they feel thinner to me and then the sides are, your side pockets are glittery. And there is an embroidering in silver foil type thread, um, which is absolutely stunning, of Space Mountain. And I'll show you that up close as well. It's uh, like this on both sides, although it don't have Space Mountain on this side. It's just plain. Uh, the straps are stiff, just like a patent leather. Your extension straps are white. They do not fold them up and tie them because of the material. So they just let them tuck up under the bag and chipping. On the back, you've got Space Mountain. Let me bring it up close, okay? Okay, so you see there's Space Mountain right there. And you can see how shimmery and glitter, not glittery, but reflective. Um, the patent leather look is. I don't know if it's true patent leather or if it's an uh, imitation of such. Here is the side. And you can see the embroidered Space Mountain right here. And that is absolutely beautiful. And you can see these are not sequins. It's a glitter embellishment of some kind that's on there. Uh, but you do have side pockets. And then here's the plain side. And then let's look around to the front. And um, here is your hidden Mickey in the galaxy. Isn't that so cute? I love it. And of course you have the buttons as if it's Mickey's pants and this gorgeous white logo tag. I just think they're beautiful. The ears are all glitter. It does have silver hardware, which I think is very appropriate for this bag. And let's look inside. Um, again, I don't think I've even seen the inside. Oh, it's just a galaxy. Uh, so let me show you the inside. There it is. And does this have an inside pocket? We'll see. Nope. No inside pocket. And the front does not have an inside pocket either. Uh, again, this is the original silhouette. Um, I don't even remember if the original Minnie Mouse, uh, the series for Minnie Mouse had interior pockets or not. But anyway, this bag is truly beautiful. Okay, so uh, I just got this in recently. And oh, I love it. I got this in from my friends over at Shiny Shopper. And y'all, I will, as always, um, put my discount codes and all of the shops that I am an affiliate with down in the description box. Um, you can save anywhere from 5 to 10% um, from these shops. And y'all, that is significant savings when you're buying $100. You know, a bag will cut $100 in two. So, you know, you definitely need to use those savings. 
And Shiny Shopper is an affiliate of mine, so I will definitely have uh, my coupon code, which is always the same, Pixie Dust Peach. I try to make it the same for all of my affiliates. Anything that I'll work with somebody on, I try to keep it the same discount code so that my followers, all of my Disney Peaches, will, it will be so much easier for you to just go from place to place. If you find something at any place, you can use the same discount code and that's always Pixie Does Peach. So anyway, this is from Shiny Shopper. You know I'm a huge, huge Beauty and the Beast fan and something just went flying. I don't know what it was. I hope it wasn't part of the bag. But, <laughs> I'm hoping it's just paper. But, ah, I got Gaston. Oh, I love Gaston. Oh my gosh, y'all. Yo, I absolutely love this bag. You know I'm a huge Beauty and the Beast fan. And this Gaston is amazing. This, uh, the whole top of Gaston's head is an applique so uh it is just so beautifully detailed um this is part of the villain scene series that releases every month as part of the the pre-orders for the month and um oh my gosh i forget which one which month this was for i felt like i ordered it so long ago but um in that series every pocket on the front has a scene from the movie and so this particular one, of course, is Beauty and the Beast. And this is a lenticular uh, front pocket, which means it changes from scene to scene. You can turn it one way and see something a different way. So I think one is the Beast and the other one is Belle um, with her book. So let's see. And I love the detail on that. Um, I love the colors chosen are, you know, Gaston's outfit, the beautiful black logo tag with gold. Oh my gosh. I'm in love with that. Um, <clears throat> the back has got brown leather, vegan leather straps. And then the back says biceps to spare, which is part of the song. You can see it says biceps to spare right there. And um, it just has that golden trim. It's black on the bottom. Each side does have a side pocket. I love the three tones, the gold, the red, and the black. Um, this is a softer vegan leather, I feel. This side is the beautiful logo tag. Look at that gorgeous black piano finish. And then you have the gold. Oh, I love it. So, um, oh, let's see if we can do the lenticular thing. So, all right. So, there's Bale. There's Beast. All right. So, at least I did it for a second. <laughs> um, let's look inside and see if there's anything. Oh, yes. They do continue Gaston's face down in the pocket. I love that when they do that. It just kind of finishes it off, don't it? So, sometimes they'll do that, sometimes they won't, but I'm glad that they did. Again, gold hardware. Just love it. Let's see what the inside looks like. Ooh. Oh, I love it. It is just pictures of Gaston, LeBou, the Bim, uh, what do you call them, Bimbets? Those girls that, like, swoon over him. Let's look at it. You see? I love it. And there is a slip pocket in the back, not a zipper. So, um, <clears throat> I do, I'm not going to lie, I do wish Loungefly had more functionality on the inside of their bags. Um, because, you know, the side pockets are hard to fit things in. So, that just leaves you the front pocket. And in this case, it's a really small front pocket. So, um, you know, if if Loungefly had slip pockets, like two slip pockets, like Danielle Nicole or Coach or Dooney, Vera Bradley, if you had those on the front, it would give you so much more functionality. And um, I hope one day they might start doing that. But... The design is absolutely beautiful. I'm in love with Gaston. Um, he is the greatest villain, I'm telling you. Um, but his face shows it too. So let me show you what else comes with this bag, okay? Yes, I got the wallet. I'm trying not to buy the wallet as much because I do use 
the same wallet a lot over and over and <clears throat> but you never know when you want to switch off into it but here is the beautiful wallet i love it the uh gaston pose and bell are all appliques and then you got this beautiful artwork on the back then you have the bimbets or whatever you call those i, I don't know why i'm calling it that labu and then the logo tag look at this up close so there is a such a perfect representation of gaston and bell and i just love this wallet the artwork is amazing and then you have the three girls that just swoon over gaston there's labu his fateful trusty mate and then you have the beautiful logo tag i just love it the artwork is amazing gold hardware and it is the oh i love this look at this oh my gosh the thing that they have on the back of the backpack they got in the wallet biceps to spare is an embossing of that you have card slots galore slider pockets id slider you've got a coin pouch and a bill compartment and look at this oh this looks amazing here it is look at that can you see that biceps to spare and we get to see gaston's muscles but love it you do have a zipper pocket for coins right there now this gold is a bit more of a yellow tone gold i think they darkened the gold or chose a different color of gold for this hardware um, because it there is a lot there are a lot of yellow tones in this so um, I think that's appropriate um, to choose a little bit darker gold um, than what we're accustomed to seeing but I absolutely love it so how beautiful is Gaston and his wallet together so gorgeous so another bag that I got from shiny shopper um is one that I've been wanting I actually forgot I ordered it <laughs> thank the lord I didn't order it again but y'all you know how I do love Ariel I love Little Mermaid I love Eric but my favorite scene to get is obviously kiss the girl but anything in those color tones anything with ariel and the water um i really love and so i had to get this bag y'all and i'm so glad i did it is absolutely beautiful okay y'all this is it is it not beautiful um this is i believe at the beginning of the movie where she pops up out of the water with flounder and sebastian and she sees the boat that eric is on and y'all i just love these colors i just love the moon y'all this bag actually lights up let me show you that in a second um it does have side pockets um, on both sides and this is kind of a softer uh, vegan leather which I love I love the soft vegan leathers um, and then here's the back and it has got um, uh, what's the bird's name uh, I forget it'll come to me I know but it's the fireworks and everything and then you've got him back there so pretty I love the big front pocket that is singing my song i love it um i love that it just opens so easily you've got very spacious pocket to put all your needed valuables in there and y'all it has silver hardware which i think is beautiful on this bag and y'all let me show you the inside and we'll cut the light on okay you can see it is a beautiful blue and it has all of the character well it just has uh the bird in there i still it hadn't come to me yet <laughs> and it also has the thing that you cut your light on with let's see if there's a pocket of some kind yes it's a slip pocket it's not a zipper so you do have that and let's cut it on you just flip the switch and here is i've got so much light in here i hope that you can tell 
this is a light, this is a light, and that is a light. So let me see if I can cut it off and you see the difference. Okay, I just cut them off. Now I cut them on. So, absolutely beautiful. I love it. It is a favorite. It is going to be so beautiful. Like I said, I don't collect everything Little Mermaid, but the things that I do collect are absolutely beautiful. And um, they all, except for this piece, these are the only two pieces that are not in like your darker blues for me. And although I do like the lighter colors too, but I guess it's just that I like the kiss scene so much. Um, and I know that's not this, but this really, the coloring everything reminds me of that. And I think they would go very well together, displayed. So I love it. I'm so glad I picked this up. So thank you to Shiny Shopper. And um, they did a wonderful job getting this bag to me. Okay, guys, I've got another bag from Shiny Shopper. Again, I love Shiny Shopper. I shop with them a lot, and they have always done a fabulous job um, for me, and I gladly represent them, um, and they do such top quality work. Um, like everybody else, I got the gorgeous Peter Pan bag, and um, I'm just tickled that I got it. Now, I think this comes off. This is a protectant. That is so pretty, but look at the clock tower, y'all. Here is the big face of the clock. And the hands do move. If you, you can move it to whatever you want. I don't think they move individually, the hands, but if you move one, the other moves also. But, oh, I love it. It's got the Nana uh, zipper pull. It's a real small front pocket. Um, but I absolutely love this whole scene right here. I think it's beautiful. I love it. On the side, you do have side pockets. Of course, I'm going to bring it up and let you see everything up close. It's just a little bit of pixie dust. Oh, my gosh, y'all. I didn't even realize that was on there. But I, I'm glad it is. It reminds me of my channel. And then you have the beautiful logo tag right there. It's got gorgeous gold hardware. Oh, I love it. Oh my gosh. Okay, I want to show you everything on the outside up close. I'm going to pull this open and just see. Uh, yeah. There's nothing else in this pocket. You know, like how it continues down from the top. Um, so, it's just this particular look here on the front. But let me bring it up and let you see it. Look how gorgeous this clock tower is. So, it starts way up here. And you've got Peter Pan. You've got Wendy. Um, there are... One of them's John. Little John. I forget what the other one's name is. And, of course, they're just flying in the air. It is so beautiful, y'all. I just love it. And this is Mitzi's favorite. She has a huge collection. Oh, and look at Nana. Look at Nana. Is that not adorable? Just love it. Um, Mitzi has a huge Peter Pan collection, and, uh, she got this bag also. So, let's look inside and see what's in the interior. Oh, look how beautiful! It is just like, um, what do you, the skyscape, you know, how you see, just like the silhouettes. Look how pretty. Isn't that gorgeous? I just love it. I love anything yellow. You know that. Again, it is just a slip pocket. Do we see a pattern here? Is Loungefly going to nothing but slip pockets now instead of a zipper? It's an interesting question. We'll, we'll just have to watch and see. Um, but every bag I've done so far has been a slip pocket, if a pocket at all. So, um, just a heads up on that. But it's absolutely stunning. 
I love this bag. I love it. Even it's just for Nana alone. I love it. <laughs> okay, so the next thing I want to show you is something I think, well, I don't know. It's tied with another bag that I it's been the longest wait for. Um, this was from Comic Spot. This is the first time I ever purchased from Comic Spot. So Mitzi and I ordered this same bag, and again, it was a really long wait. Um, but I'm so excited to be able to use it this year um, because it's more for a hot... Well, some people carry this uh, movie year-round, and it's great. I mean, I watch it year-round, uh, but more than not, I usually carry it seasonally, like in the fall. So, um, and this is so beautiful. Now that I finally have it, it is beautiful, and it is the Jack and Sally bag. I love it. Oh my gosh. You know, I'm a huge Nightmare Before Christmas fan. Predominantly Jack and Sally. And I like Zero. But, um, mostly I collect just Jack and Sally. And here's the tag. It's so pretty. And y'all, I love this. When I saw it, I said I wanted to get it so badly. I love this whole detail work here of Jack on the face. The bottom is the striping representing his suit. The pocket is Sally, and it's a smaller pocket. Um, it ain't too terribly bad, but it is smaller. Her eyes are appliques. Uh, her lips are embroidered. It feels, oh, no, no, I'm sorry. It's an applique as well. And of course, Jack's bow tie is an applique also. His eyes are embroidered. So, it is a beautiful, beautiful bag. Let's see if his face carries down into the pocket. Oh, it does! And look, you see his bow tie. I love it. <gasps> what? I love it. This is so beautiful. And again, it's a smaller circular pocket uh, of Sally. You can see um, how that looks. And y'all, look at this gorgeous logo tag. It says Disney's Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas. All of Nightmare Before Christmas says that. Um, all of their plaques, all their logo tags, everything will say that. Look how stunning that logo tag is. It's just absolutely beautiful. And I love the stripe, black and white stripes. That's my favorite, one of my favorite aspects of Jack and Sally or Jack bags is having that striped suit. I'm, I go to that every time. And then the back, you've got uh, vegan leather, padded strap. The extension straps have a beautiful pattern on it. Isn't that pretty? And it goes so well with your black vegan leather. And y'all, look at the back. Is this supposed to be um, zero or just a bat? Anyway, I'm not sure. Let's look at that. Look at that. So what do y'all think that is? It kind of looks like a bat. I love the spider webs. And everything is embroidered. But I love it. The bottom has... Uh, black le uh, vegan leather. I love the gold hardware. Although silver would have been beautiful on this as well. Let's look at the inside. Oh, I love this bag. I'm so glad I got it. Despite the weight, I'm glad I got it. Oh, look. It's got uh, just a bunch of beautiful designs. It's got Jack on the inside mostly. Just Jack's face everywhere. So, let's look at that. Isn't that pretty? Such a pretty design. I love it. Let's see what we got on the back wall. We have a slip pocket. So, another slip pocket yet again. So, here we go. It is absolutely beautiful. So glad I waited on this bag. Y'all, I still have so much to show you, honestly. Um, <laughs> This is a big haul. I meant it. Um, Y'all, I'm actually carrying this bag right now. And it just came in. Um, and it is from Vera Bradley. It is not a Disney bag. But it is a small backpack. 
which is very similar in size to lounge fly and um probably more in depth to the size of uh maybe daniel nicole's backpack but it is a, a small or mini backpack size not anything like the aerial one that i got that had the drawstring it's way bigger than that this is more of what i like in size uh, with vera bradley and y'all it is the small backpack is it <laughs> I absolutely love it. I think it is so spring. I I love floral. I love pink and I love yellow. So this bag is absolutely beautiful. I believe this is called Bloom Boom. And um I just think it's absolutely gorgeous. I love the pink flowers um all over. The pattern goes all the way to the back so beautiful vera bradley is another affiliate of mine um i have a discount code pixie dust peach just like everything else um the only bad thing about my code with vera bradley is you can't use it on collaborations so that would mean disney star wars you know snoopy anything that's is with a collaboration it just has to be vera bradley's line so like this you could get the 10 percent discount and it's a 10 percent discount with pixie dust peach and um you will love their backpack i i just i'm so impressed with it y'all um this is their front pocket i've actually got stuff in here so just overlook that i actually uh wanted a bag with the interior print but it didn't come in that pattern it's the interior of this pattern so at least i get my favorite print um on the inside so anyway you get this really spacious front pocket and you can see the gorgeous yellow on the inside but y'all you get a slip and a pencil slide and another spacious pocket in there this is so functional I can't even tell you and it's huge front pocket you get two side pockets that are very spacious my phone actually fits almost down in the pocket look at that i just put my phone in there and it almost fits totally submerged in there so i am very confident to carry my phone in the side pocket however if i didn't want to do that on the back it has look at this it has another big spacious slip pocket on the back you could take it and lay it sideways and put it down in there against your back so that is another option but it's a very very spacious uh back pocket back here which i'm just blown away with the functionality honestly and this is just a ribbing going around the pocket so there's nothing up here but you do have your zipper there you have your side pockets and then you have another slide on the back you have padded straps uh black extension straps and then you have a ribbon that's black you have two zippers and the zippers are amazing you can look in here and see how gorgeous this pattern is let me see if i can show you up close so this is the pattern that i really wanted on the outside um and what goes with this on the bag is like a band of it's either butterflies or flowers i can't remember but it's a contrasting band and it's absolutely beautiful but on the side of this uh on the inside of this the front pocket has a slip there and another slip there so you've got two slip pockets on the front and then you have a big zipper on the back and y'all it's absolutely beautiful i also bought the eyeglass case um it has a slip on the front and another slip here and it has a thing that you can hook to if you have um you want to put it on your keys or if you have one of those 
key keepers in your bag, whatever you're carrying, you could do that. But I bought that because like, when I carry my lounge fly bags, there are no inside slip pockets. So I have a hard time because I have to wear prescription glasses and prescription sunglasses. And I don't like the big bulky cases. And I like the slip pockets that I can just slip my glasses in. So I bought that for the times that I'm carrying a bag that does not have the slip pockets on the front, which I absolutely love absolutely love and y'all i just love your bradley i do i'm not saying that because you know me even be before i come and affiliate became an affiliate with them I've always carried Vera Bradley. I've always bought Vera Bradley, especially Disney Vera Bradley. And so, um, yeah, I had to pick this one up and I've been carrying it for two days and I absolutely love it. The so. next thing I want to share with you is the only second purchase I've ever made from Stitch Shop. And it came this week and I was so tickled, y'all. <gasps> You know how I've been actually getting a bunch, well, I won't say a bunch, but several exclusives from the seven drawers. And y'all, I had to get this beauty. This is the gorgeous bag from Loungefly. This is, oh, you get a pin. Every time you buy something from Stitch Shop, if it's just bags or if it's clothes too but i know with a bag every time you buy something from stitch shop you get a special pin from lounge fly and it is so pretty and it's got stitch shop on it i'll show you that in a second it's kind of hooked on to the strap hooks that are the golden hardware that's right here but y'all i love the glitter that is in the background of this gorgeous gorgeous piece so beautiful. Look, there's the logo tag. Look how beautiful that logo tag is. Oh my gosh. So that looks like Doc, Bashful, Grumpy, Happy. Is that Sneezy? No, that's Sneezy. That must be Sleepy. And we're back to Doc. So, absolutely love it. Oh, and you got the favorite of mine. Dopey, right on the top. I think Dopey's a lot of, of folks' favorite. You got the pretty little birds from the forest and a bunny. Oh, and it's got gorgeous, gorgeous gold hardware. Here's the pen you get of Dopey. And let's open it up real quick and see what's on the inside. I've never opened one like this, so it might take me a minute. Oh, okay, that goes there. This goes on around. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Here we go, we're gonna open it up. Oh, it's beautiful. You've got your chain with the vegan leather strap. And then let's take this paper out. Oh my gosh. It is just like a huge bucket. Look at that beautiful. Look at that beautiful interior. And then you have a zipper pocket right here in the middle. Oh, wow. I didn't, never would have thought you would have been able to get a zipper pocket in this bag. <laughs> but design, right? So you've got a spacious, even though you fit something down in there and it might be a little tall, you've got space to close because this is very uh, elevated up. So you could fit whatever in there and, and it still fit. Even though it sticks up out of here, it'll still fit with this lid because it's so domed. I love it. It is so beautiful. But I absolutely love it, y'all. Just stunning. Oh, I am so glad I picked this bag up. Unfortunately, it's sold out. But... Oh, it's just beautiful. Thank you, Stitch Shop, for a gorgeous, gorgeous bag. Okay, another bag. Honestly, y'all, I totally forgot um, that I had ordered it. <laughs> it is beautiful, nonetheless. And it is from the Princess Castle series, which I've 
decided to stop collecting. Um, only get the pieces that I really, really want. So I probably bought this before I made that decision, if that makes sense. So um, with that said though, it came in and it is truly beautiful. Uh, it truly is. And it is the Sleeping Beauty uh, Princess Castle series. And y'all, this whole castle is an applique on the bag. Um, this part here with Aurora and this part down here is an applique. Um, it's got this beautiful blue uh, logo tag. Absolutely gorgeous. The birds are embroidered. This is just art print, all of this right here. Um, it's got a mixture of blue and lavender, which is absolutely beautiful. You do have side pockets on both sides. And y'all, the back has got padded blue straps with lavender, uh, a little bit darker lavender, light purple um, extension straps. Um, it's from the Princess series and this is gorgeous. And they lived happily ever after. Look how gorgeous this is. Is that not stunning? And then you can see the writing down at the bottom. You've got blue at the bottom. That's a beautiful pose. And look how part of the gown has some blue in it. And the predominant is pink. That is so pretty. So, it's either make it pink or make it blue. Such a pretty, pretty piece. Uh, it has gorgeous uh, hardware. It's gold. The pretty gold color, too. I love that. And let's see the inside. Oh, gosh. I love the inside, y'all. It is the fairies. And it's got Aurora's crown. Everything is in a purpley lavender background but then all of the others the fairies and everything it's in jewel tone colors look look how stunning that is that's a beautiful beautiful lining oh i love it such a pretty bag and it has a slip pocket so y'all i feel like lounge white has gone away from your zippers unless maybe it's for special bags, uh, exclusives, or something like that for them. These zippers are still fantastic on the outside. But so far, we've only been getting slip, one big slip pocket, and that's it. There's no front pocket on this bag. You only have side pockets. And, um, but y'all, the artwork is amazing. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous love it now not only did i get this i got something else apparently <laughs> i decided to get the wallet <laughs> the wallet y'all is just as gorgeous as the bag the castle yet again is an applique and then you just have all of the beautiful background um on it let me show you so you do have um your beautiful castle and then if you go to the back the gorgeous, beautiful print of Sleeping Beauty and her prints. And it has the blue. It's kind of like an ombre. Like it's going from blue to uh, pink. And I love the lavender trim. And it has gold hardware also. And I love the beautiful logo tag up at the top. Loungefly has great zippers, y'all. Honestly, they do. I really love them. This is your elongated style, just as was, um, what was that other wallet? The Beauty and the Beast wallet. Um, and it is uh, very spacious. It gives you more than enough card space. Um, your slider ID, it's the exact same silhouette. You have a couple of slip pockets, um, another slider for your... Um, dollar money and then you have a coin pouch for your coins and on the pouch it says and they lived happily ever after and it's just printed on isn't that beautiful so pretty so just a fabulous job on the wallet honestly i mean loungefly does a great job on their wallets honestly i really I really love their wallet. So, the wallet and the bag are absolutely gorgeous together. 
Okay, so another thing that I want to show you is a bag that I actually got from a personal shopper. Um, I've always wanted it. It is from uh, Galaxy's Edge. And um, I said, you know what? They're not available in the parks to my knowledge anymore. And I said, I want this bag so bad. And y'all, she picked it up for me. It was $39.99. And then, you know, the shipping and her little fee with it. I can't remember now exactly what I paid for it, but it was way less than retail. And so, I had her pick it up, and I'm so excited. Look at the presentation. Look how beautiful. She put it in this big netted um, uh, sheer bag, which I thought was such a lovely touch. And um, I just am just so tickled that I went ahead and got this bag. And again, it's just a Disney bag. It is not lounge fly, but y'all, I don't care. I wanted this for my collection. I think this is absolutely stunning. It has a dark blue background. And then it has all of your droids on it. It's got C-3PO, R2-D2, and I guess some others maybe. But it has that real inside detailed look like you're in, looking inside of a hard drive or something. And it says Droid Depot. So I love this, y'all. It obviously must have come from the Droid Depot. I love this half moon um, zipper pocket. And y'all, oh, it had a pretty good zipper too. That's very spacious for a small pocket. So I'm tickled pink that I've got that, that space there. I'm a huge fan of gold. And this kind of represents C-3PO, in my opinion. And you do have side pockets, and it's lined in the gold. On the back, you've just got more of the droid uh, type stuff on the back. It does have the real bright gold padded straps and gold extension strap um, as well and both sides have the pockets y'all I absolutely love it let me bring it up so you can see the front really good okay so here we go um, you can see all of the droids on there and all of that detail work in the back then it has the uh, droid depot right here I just love this gold trim. It's absolutely beautiful. I love it. The bottom is trimmed in gold. And I cannot wait until my other one gets here. Let's look inside and see what is all in here. Now, I've never looked inside. There's just a little bit of padding. So I'm going to take that out so we can really see it. Because it's going to be dark. Let's see. There's no pockets anywhere. So this is absolutely nothing in the inside uh the interior it just has that same um i don't know that you can see it, it just still has that like you're looking inside a hardware or something like that on the inside very dark but it has star wars tag on the inside and it says galaxy's edge so i love it oh my gosh Y'all, I'm tickle pink to have this. You don't know how bad I wanted this. If I get somebody to pick something up for me, you know I want it pretty bad. <laughs> okay, I've got another bag. Um, this is the last bag I got for Star Wars. But I pre-ordered, they had two exclusives. And I, I hope there's a tag in here somewhere. But I forget who uh, this was with, um, to be honest with you. Um, but... I got one, the first one that came out, and then, well, you actually bought these at the same time, but they were late getting this one here to us, so, y'all, it is Obi-Wan, Obi-Wan Kenobi, oh my gosh, yes, oh my gosh, y'all, I love it, and it don't say who it was with, oh my gosh, I thought for sure I had a tag telling me, but anyway, um, this was ordered through one of the small shops in our Disney community. Oh, this tan feels just like um, suede. Oh, I love it. Oh my gosh, I love it. 
This is insane, y'all. This thing is stunning. If you're a Star Wars fan, I hope that you got this bag. Um, this is a keeper. This is supposed to be the outfit of Obi-Wan Kenobi, and I think it looks amazing. You've got his belt right here with all of this detailing. Just unbelievable. You have his... Uh, lightsaber as a zipper pull and then you've got the beautiful logo tag and a tan color everything is this suede feel with brown leather vegan leather trim um, it has two side pockets on either side you do have a, a pocket here it's kind of flat you can see um, it's not extended so I probably won't use that just because I don't want to mess it up and um, but look at the back y'all it has the brown uh vegan leather straps y'all you have the jedi symbol and the name jedi on the back so beautiful oh my gosh let me show you the lightsaber up close okay there is your lightsaber and then this is what the front belt looks like so beautiful there's your logo tag I just love it. Oh my gosh. This is just stunning to me. If you're a Star Wars fan, you're loving this bag right now, honestly. And let's see what the inside looks like. Oh, it just says Obi-Wan Kenobi and it has the Jedi symbol on the inside. You see that? I hope. And what does it have in the bag? It has a zipper! We, <laughs> we finally have a zipper. <laughs> Out of all these bags I've shown you today, we finally have a zipper. I'm so in love with this bag. And y'all, I'm just tickled pink that um, I got it because guess what? Whoops. Guess what? I also had gotten Anakin. Anakin came also. This came way early. And then now Obi-Wan is here. So now they're together again. I love it. These are so in my collection. Oh my gosh. I'm just so proud of my Star Wars collection. I've got so many bags. I mean, anything from Danielle Nicole to lounge. It's mostly lounge fly um, is what I have. But I absolutely love my collection. And I'm thinking maybe for May 4th, I might do a, a Star Wars collection video. So keep an eye out for that. I want to do something fun for May 4th. May the 4th be with you. So love these. Okay, I got a couple more bags to show you. I'm so excited to share these. These are actually Daniel McCall bags that I actually purchased. And um, this first one, I believe, came from Box Lunch. And when I saw it, I knew I wanted it because I want to collect all of the Princess series like this. Um, I'm just missing the first one. And it is the Cinderella one. And y'all, I got the Snow White. It is absolutely beautiful. Most of the ones that she does um, for this series is this same silhouette. You can see right back here, there's my bell one that's right over my shoulder. And it's the same silhouette as this. The one that I'm missing from Cinderella is the same silhouette. It just has different detailing. Like this has got your apple on it. And, um, and it has a different look on the front pocket, obviously. Um, but it's got these red beads that resemble an apple. And they're just going through the whole ribbon. And you can see the bow. Um, effect there. It's so beautiful. There's beautiful, you know, all of the little God's little creatures in the forest um, are on here. You've got the little deers and uh, the little baby birds, the squirrels, um, the bunny rabbits. It's all on here. And then down here on the bottom, you've got uh, just a white, kind of a transparent almost, um, apple and a little bird and it's got s's for snow white let me bring this up and let you see it okay so here is the front 
and you can see the pocket it just has the edging like a little ribbon here's your bows with all the little apple stones and then you have all your little creatures or little babies and then up here you've got the beautiful design in the bottom um, of the apple and the little bird and there's an S for Snow White and then you've got the charm which is so beautiful um, this is Snow White sitting down and it is just beautiful um, actually it looks like if you didn't want to use the charm you could take that off you've got the handles here um, let me go ahead and take off all of this padding. So, uh, Danielle Nicole really packaged her, her items up really well for protection. I didn't think I was going to ever get all this paper off up here. I'm going to leave it on the strap. You have a small chain um, uh, right here, but then you have the vegan leather strap as well. Uh, but yeah, it is absolutely beautiful. There's the side, um, here's the bottom. And then let me show you the back, uh, the tag of Daniel Nicole. And then it has Daniel Nicole and gold, gold foil on the back, her logo. So you can see there, Daniel Nicole. And it has the same pattern on the back. And you can see this S and the W for Snow White. Let me show you when you lift up the front closure. Look, there's a beautiful, beautiful scene here. And honestly, y'all, that writing is so small, I cannot read it. You'll have to look at it when you <laughs> when I come up close. Uh, but it has the house with the seven dwarfs. You got some more of the little squirrels and birds and things. She always puts a beautiful detailing here uh, from the movie. So let me bring this up so you can see it. So here it is. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my gosh, I love it. And then on the inside, um, you have on the crossbody, you just have one. She always just has the same interior, unless it's something special, I guess. Um, but the inside interior is just a dark gray, charcoal color, and it just has the little D ends for Danielle Nicole. Um, and that's standard for her on this you even a bag this small you still have a big front slip pocket and a zipper on the back with her uh a vegan leather tag for danielle nicole so y'all i love danielle nicole she does a fabulous job and her uh designs are absolutely beautiful and like I said, I'm trying to collect all of these. Um, I've got to get the Cinderella one somehow. I've seen it a couple of times on Macari, but it's just crazy expensive. And so I'm trying to wait till I can find a really good deal. But yeah, I've got this one. I've got Belle back here, which I love. And I got one more to show you. Y'all, I actually saved the best one for last. And it's really not, it's a crossbody from Danielle Nicole, but it's not from the Princess series. It's from the 50th anniversary of Disney World. Yes. <laughs> yes, I got the one for Disney World. Oh my gosh. Y'all, I had to have this bag. There was no way I wasn't getting this bag. It is absolutely stunning. Now, I think some small shops have this bag. And you could actually use my coupon code um, to pick this one up. Y'all, I've just got to look at it. This is unbelievable. Oh my gosh. It is really almost exactly like the princess uh, ones. It's just a little bit different. And I love this, y'all. Oh my gosh, I'm going to take all of this stuff off. Okay, y'all, I took the paper off the top. I'm telling you, she really, really packs this thing <laughs> because it was so hard to get all that off. Um, oh, y'all, this is just absolutely gorgeous. I mean, you have your handle up here and it has this beautiful pink little ribbon um, on here and it's got glitter embellishments all over it. Let me show you the ribbon. Look how beautiful the ribbon is just on the handle. 
it's kind of stationary, but I guess you could probably slide it a little bit. Y'all, we've got golden thread embroidery. All of the detailing is in gold thread. You've got that same uh, pink ribbon right here. And uh, you have the, you Cinderella. Have the Cinderella clock in the background. There's glitter embellishments all around. You have another clock here. And y'all look down here, you've got a heart lock that says Cinderella. And then you also have the key. Oh my God, this is unbelievable. It is a charm on the front of the bag. Now this, um, you lift up, I'm sure it's a snap closure. And we'll go ahead and take this off for a moment. Oh my gosh, look at that. You have the rest of the castle down here. Is it not stunning? While we have it open, let's look inside. You've got your strap, which is all vegan leather. Oh, look at this. Oh my gosh, is that not absolutely stunning? Oh my gosh, um, you've got that heart um, charm that is so thick. It's weighty. It's got Cinderella on it. It's got the keyhole. And then you've got the beautiful key. Oh my gosh. I'm leaving that plastic on for now. I don't want to mess it up. Oh my gosh. Y'all, this is my favorite purchase so far for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> you got your sides and then on the back you've got Daniel Nicole the back is just simple you got Daniel Nicole written there in gold foiling it's just a very elegant it's very elegant um bag and I absolutely love this oh my gosh y'all I'm in love wow so beautiful they do have um they do have a backpack, but it's of Disneyland Castle. So, since Disney World is my home park, and it's the part, only part I've ever been to, um, I chose to go with the Disney World. But y'all, I'm absolutely in love with this. I had to save this one to last. I started out good, and I ended good. <laughs> but y'all, that's it. That is my whole haul. Oh, I forgot something. I got one more thing to show you. It's not a bag, but hold on, I get it. Y'all, I did get one thing. It is a Funko Pop. It is the Cinderella Castle, Mickey, uh, Cinderella Castle and Mickey Mouse. It's number 26. It's for the Walt Disney World 50th anniversary. I think I've shown this on Instagram, but I haven't shown it here. But y'all, I'm not taking it out of the box. I'm so sorry, but I do want to show you that I did get it. Look, and see if I can get all of the glare off of it. Oh, I hope I can. How's that? I hope it's showing up. But you can see the beautiful castle, and then you see Mickey Mouse up in the top corner. Um, and then you can see here it says for Disney, Walt Disney World 50th. It is so pretty. Here's the back. Um, it shows you what was actually in there. But yeah i love it oh my gosh it is beautiful and i really am glad i've kind of stopped collecting funko pops to be honest with you i just don't have the space for them but i knew this was going to be something that would be iconic and it would be something that i could cherish because it was for 50 years 50 years is a big deal it's like the golden anniversary <laughs> and hence the gold so anyway now that's it y'all that is everything from my haul today i hope that you stayed with me and that you enjoyed everything um yeah if you have any questions drop it down below and thank you again and we'll see you the next time bye